there, it's Christy. I am an independent 31 consultant. Um, I named my business page Heartstrings and Gifty Things because I like to connect with people. So that so I hope that you like this video doing a product feature of different uses for the close to home caddy. And if you do, if you would make a connection with me and just say hi, say thank you, um, tell me you're gonna use one of my uh, hints or um, give me a hint that I could maybe use too. So um, thank you for showing up. I'm gonna do my product feature. Hey guys, I'm gonna do a quick product feature of the close to home caddy. So I love this wood. Um, this is mango wood from India. So it's got like all this beautiful life to it. Look how gorgeous. Um, and each piece is unique. And then um, it is laser etched here in the good old US of A. Um, mine says slancha which is the Irish word for cheers. Um, and it's brand new, so I wanna do some feature with it. So what do you do with this thing? So many different things. So some people like to um, put sort of like a, a personalization on here that's like eat, drink, and be merry or something like that. And use it out at their picnic table. Um, so uh, you could probably fit some condiments or napkins or um, straws, other things like that in here for those kinds of purposes. So that's that's one use. Um, I'm I'm thinking kitchen sink. Now I wouldn't necessarily guarantee that if get, this gets wet that that's okay. Um, but maybe with certain items like I have all these different brushes. Um, so this is like the I mean maybe you're not crazy like this you know but this is my regular brush. This is the brush for. For the dog stuff, oops, I picked something that doesn't fit. Uh, that's for the dog stuff because that brush is just extra gross. Um, and then this is another brush for dog stuff. But like, do you have a Kong for your dog? It's like got this deep, um, deep hole, and like it's got to be thin to get in there. So this is the special brush for that. So that could be a sink caddy. You could also maybe put oh well some other sink stuff. So. Do you wash these these bottles and things out and just try to find uses for them because they're just so interesting? I do. So that's another thing, actually. You could um, fill different bottles with different types of stuff and put them in here. Um, that could become like a triple vase kind of thing there with your simple decorations. Um, also at the sink, let me turn my labels away for, you know, so I don't get have to pay anybody for advertising or whatever. Um, so I've got some spray, some dishwasher liquid, di uh, soap, dishing, dish soap, and this is hand soap. So that's another thing at the sink. Um, but I wouldn't necessarily recommend that for like, you know, the bathroom with children. They would get soap all over it and everything like that. And, and it's just not made to be constantly wet either. But this would be off to the side of my sink and I, I could handle not getting it all wet. Okay. Another thing is that it's just perfect for succulents, and succulents are in right now. They're like a really good home accent. Um, so I've got this cactus here that, of course, I put in a jar, right? Because that's just what I've been doing. Oh, I don't know if this is my only succulent, and it's um, it's in a little rough shape, but um, I would pick a diff maybe a different size pot there so that would fit down in there. And then I just discovered that this isn't going to fit in there that great. There you go. Um, oh, I lost another leaf. I am a biology teacher, but I'm really not that great with plants. So um, that's another way you can put, you know, three small matching succulents or cactuses because those are also kind of an in-home accent right now. So that's another use for the close-to-home caddy. And then another use is, um, do you guys all have like this place in your home where you like the kids hand you stuff? And you're like, thank you. And then it's like, okay, it goes on a windowsill or something. Well, that's something like, this could be like a nature box. And actually the close to home decor box, same thing. You could put your special rocks and seashells and feathers and stuff. I found a nest. So I could just balance that nest right there. I could put my special rocks in there and then I could put my special feathers or seashells in here. Um, 
And then maybe I would personalize that with like memories or um, back to nature or something like that. So those are just a few ideas that you can use the close to home caddy for. Um, so, hey, why, uh, how about you comment anything that you're using it for or just at least say hi. Um, so I know that you saw this and I hope that somebody saw something inspirational. So um, thank you for watching. Have a great day.